We have the Black Soul Stone at last, despite Zoltan Kuhl's betrayal. I always knew he couldn't be trusted. Fortunately, we were able to defeat him and retrieve the stone. I learned that my mother had secretly bound the Fallen Lords of Hell to it. I just wonder why she didn't tell me. I can be ready to leave at a moment's notice. Let me know when you are prepared to go.
The keep's defenses cannot hold. Its soldiers are scattered, fleeing before Asnodan's onslaught, which rushes forth from Ariat Crater. Should the keep fall, Asnodan will claim the Black Soul Stone. If he does, there will be no hope for this world. I will not let that happen. Light the signal fires and show these soldiers that we are not yet defeated. Salvation has arrived. Go, you are needed below. A few thousand of your years ago on a distant battlefield, I stood over Asmodan, sword raised to deliver the death blow. You did not kill him. No. One of my brethren, Ardleon, called for help. A distraction. Yes. And now Asmodan threatens all I hope to hear once again. It will not be the same. Not with our forces united. I see that now. I wish my angelic brethren felt the same. What is most different about being mortal? I will die. That is the way of all things. But that is the difference. When you are mortal, every moment is precious. Everything matters. It is exhilarating. I knew Zoltan Kuhl was special from the moment I met him. He had a keen mind for the arcane. During the hunt for the three, he was the bearer of the soul stones and must have studied them intently. Though it is an aberration, the Black Soul Stone is a testament to his genius. The Black Soul Stone was created to be an improvement over the original three. They were crafted to contain single demons, but Kool intended his to hold many. But the Black Soul Stone is flawed and cannot contain that many demons for long. We must capture Asmodan within it and shatter it lest all these evils be reborn. Of the many things I find intriguing about humans, the greatest is their endless thirst for knowledge. Angels believe that everything there is to know is written in the scroll of faith. Therefore, curiosity is not a common pathogen trait. Ironically, my suspicions have been confirmed. Angels do not, in fact, know everything. Seeing the world through mortal eyes has given me much. The Black Soul Stone's getting hotter, straining against me. They're whispering to me from inside. The demons within seek escape. Only your power can keep it from splitting apart, my daughter. It's a heavy burden, but the fate of the world lies in your hands. Yes, Leah can handle this, although it will be very hard on her. They reached Bastion's Keep, but holding the Black Soul Stone together takes up all of my time now. Sometimes I think of the wounded soldiers and their families outside. But then my concentration fails, and the spells weaken. I must stay focused, and trust my friend to save the Keep and its people. How do you fare? It's getting more difficult, but it's nothing I can't handle. The demons war and rage to escape their imprisonment. Their fury will only increase over time. Leah is very brave, but we best hurry before her strength fails. Of course. Do not worry, Leah. We will be swift. Our task is nearly complete. We need only slay Asmodan. Only fools celebrate victory before the battle's begun. Along with Belial, Asmodan has ruled the ravening hordes of the Burning Hells for over three centuries. His cunning is beyond imagining. I am yet to be impressed. Cooking and serving gruel ain't glorious, but these men can't fight and die on empty stomachs. Death may be upon us all soon. 
but I shall do what I can to ease your pain. It's time I knew the truth about your brother. We used to be a team. I tip him off to some of the Thieves Guild's hits. He'd bring in the guards and play it off like it was a lucky catch. But one time he showed up too early. When you robbed the Merchant's Guild Bank? None other. Some of the guards became suspicious. They thought he was involved. And he's been rotting in a cell in Kingsport ever since. I... Well, I managed to escape. You feel guilty? I don't know what I feel anymore. Oh, I've been waiting for this. What became of your Vigerai master? My sisters and I waited until all of his associates had gathered to summon a greater demon. We slew them all to the last man. But they uttered curses upon us with their dying breaths. My sisters and I, we fell. Our death seemed certain. When I woke, the dark figure of the Prophet was staring down at me. That is how I met him. While examining John Dar's journal further, I found a torn page hidden within the binding. I believe that it is from one of the tomes I seek. He has written notes in the border as well. Perhaps by studying them, I will learn where the tome is. A fine plan. What else? It seems strange that John Dar would keep a page hidden. It is though it is the proof of a crime. I've already found holes in my order's honor. What if there are more? It is always wonderful to see you. Let us seek honor together, my friend. I welcome the chance to travel with you. to light those signal fires. Just not me. I've dug up I came up here to dig. I'll be damned if I'm leaving without a fight. We have to hold. We were down to quarter strength, and we've held for ten days. Reinforcements have to be coming. We're down to 300 from a thousand men. And you think we can hold much longer than this? It is better to meet death gravely than to guess at its coming. Brand new goods here. No. So what if some of my goods come from dead soldiers? They're not using them anymore, are they? Nicola, please hide while I'm away. I would never forgive myself if you were hurt. Hush, husband. If you die now, at least I won't be far behind. Now go, and hurry back to me. My dad went out to stop the demons from coming in. Are you gonna help him? Please, take my children out of here. Leave me here if you have to, but take my children. You are the first to entrust a child to my care. I am unqualified for such things. I've got some new items you might need, friend. Day 9. Young... Commander Calderos believes that the demonic scourge will flee before a bloody show of righteous force. 
He intends to lead a charge from our fortifications tomorrow. Calderos can commit suicide by stupidity if he wants. But I'll be damned if I send my lads with him. My people have been lost, scattered to the winds, but I will survive as long as you. It's just unnatural to go from a place so hot to a place so cold. The change isn't good for my old bones. You can leave at any time. And what's all this noise? It's as though we're right in the middle of a battle. A great battle, even. I know, isn't it? What is on your mind, Shen? Oh, yes, yes, yes. Well, memories are useless, aren't they? You can't eat them or sell them for food. I'm glad that I'm starting to lose them. Oh, I was just remembering a time when I tracked the jewel to Scovos. A long story. But let us say that between the sea monsters and poisoned arrows, it managed to slip away again. A tragic story, then? Oh, it was. But when the theater's ceiling collapsed, I fell right into the lap of my soon-to-be seventh wife. Oh, she managed to console me. Seven wives? Isn't that excessive? Oh, no, no, no. I've been married many more times than that. But never to more than two women at a time. <laughs> never let it be said that I'm greedy. You heard the Angel's command! Let the call sound forth! Bastion's keep shall not fall! I never expected to see you outside of New Tristram. Cruel fortune has left me as a lowly merchant once again. And now I'm minutes away from slaughter by the demonic hordes. Please, escort me out of here. I will pay anything. You have learned nothing. These soldiers look barely old enough to be away from their mothers. They are not prepared for the evil that seeks to consume this keep. It takes years of training to become a worthy soldier. I couldn't agree with you more. That's why it's a good thing you're here. I cannot defend the keep alone. Oh, I don't know about that. My visions are filled with demons dying violently at your hands. Let's just say there is a lot of blood. From the burning desert to the freezing north. You don't make it easy on us, do you? Nothing is easy. At least there's a lot of work to be done here. These men fight with blunted swords and dented armor. It's good to help. What will you do when this battle is ended? That is a question for another day. It's never too early. I will return to the priests of Rathna and seek their wisdom. A noble goal. I just want a quiet town in the country where I can work and live a life of peace. I'd fight if there were any weapons to spare. They'll have to tear me apart before they get to my children. You convinced me. Troopers form the meat of the armies of hell. Nothing can save you. Light the signal fire. Demon troopers. Form the meat of the armies of hell. Their masters use them roughly, sending them into the vanguard for most battles. For their part, the troopers are easily excited by opportunities to exhibit their great talent for violence. In fact, the troopers frequently attack each other 
when they are left idle. We saw the signal fire. We must light the rest, but the demons swarm around them. Asmodan created the demonic Hell Flyers after he nearly lost to Tyrael in battle thousands of years ago. The angels made glorious use of their great luminescent wings to outmaneuver the demon host and assail its commander. Frustrated by his near defeat, Asmodan began breeding winged demons capable of tearing the angels asunder. hoped that the demonic hell-bearer was a fiction, a nightmare from the troubled minds of my ancestors. Just imagine, a demon taller than a castle tower who can retch up endless minions from the depths of the hells. Surely our people are doomed if such an abomination exists. I hear you're the best there is!
honor to fight by your side. going to die. Welcome sight, hero! It was made for another place. 
Actually, it was made for another age entirely. I suppose that's true. Those bastards didn't stand a chance. Colossal Golgor is merely a colossal myth. In folklore, they are sons of an infamous demon who smashed half of hell in anger after the prime evils were defeated during the Dark Exile. Why, if I had a gold coin for each of these tales, I would be a wealthy man indeed. Quickly, help us fight them off! I need essence. Welcome sight, hero! What in the hells was that? Nothing you should fear. We've seen the fires you've lit. Fear has no more hold on us. The catapults could break Asmodan's lines, but we can't raise them from their births while demons swarm over the walls. That is why I am here.
can turn back the tide of demons if we hurry. Thank the heavens you're here. We're down to four lads until reinforcements arrive. Trouble is, the lift stopped. We can't see what went wrong through all the muck down there. This sounds ominous. Oh, what now? More of the brutes from below, Captain. What do we do? Private, if you need to be told which end of the sword goes where, you haven't been paying attention. Fight to your last breath, lads! is moving again. Hold steady, lads. Reinforcements are on their way. Demons. Get ready, men. Victory! We would have fallen without your aid. It was an honor to fight at your side. I am only glad we made it here in time.
than you've got! must be the one that lit the signal fires. Help me free the recruits so they can raise this catapult. Over here. Excellent. Let's protect the recruits while they raise the catapult. Fire's lit and the catapult's firing on the battlefield. Bastion's keep just might hold. You've given us hope. Thank you.
as it should be. Scouts report that more of those wretched demon hellbearers will be here any moment. The soldiers need to be protected. The platform will rise more quickly if we don't lose men. Thanks to your help, we can finally get these catapults firing on the demons on the battlefield. The soldiers out there have a chance now. here alone. Of course I'm bloody well alone. Everyone else has gone and died, but I'll be damned if I'll leave my post. Make yourself useful and spin that winch. strong enough to lift you alone. Could you please ask my friend over there to lend a bloody hand? I must wait. That needs to recharge. I uh, promised Captain Ho I'd watch my temper. Do me a favor, and don't mention that I shouted at you a little, all right? I need to go back. The demons are in the keep! They're coming up from the depths! To arms! To arms! There is a disgusting, slobbering, fat-oozing demon in your future. 
But there is always time for romance. You really should find someone. Why do you speak so? Trust me, you'll appreciate having a loved one to come home to when you're done saving the world. I would ask if- You see? They can kill any of us at any time! I won't wait a second longer. I am leaving now. Anything can kill you at any time. Just be aware of that. Tell me of your past adventures. During the festival of masks many years ago, a lady stole my money pouch and a kiss from me. Of course, I had to catch her. Well, in those days, I was quite an athlete. I chased her halfway across the city's moonlit rooftops, wearing nothing more than a mask with a gigantic nose. I never caught her, but I still remember her laugh. A caravan made through for some new goods. You interested? I wish my husband had lived long enough to see you fighting for our family. Do not waste your wishes on the dead. They have no need of them. Can we go fight with you? Leave him alone. Can't you see he's busy? I thought we were all gonna die. Some die, others live. And I already know that you will survive. Nicola, are you alright? Yes. The demons never got near me. How do you face those things? Because I do it for you. They terrify me. Brand new goods here. Never you mind. The demons came out of nowhere. How are we supposed to defend against that? We don't. We just pray it doesn't happen again. Akarat's mercy. If our champion hadn't come back, we'd all be dead. How did they get in? Unholy bloody magic. You'd think all the Zacharim emblems that's between the stones would have kept them out. I've dug up some valuable new things. Really should take a look. My children aren't afraid like the others. They know we have to be strong. That brave warriors like you have to hold this place. I'm so proud of them. Asmodan's demons have opened an enormous hole in our walls and are flooding into the depths. If it is not closed, the keep will be overrun. Leave it to me. This stone is vibrating. I can barely hold it. There are voices. They're screaming in my head. Leah is losing strength. Clearly the stone wasn't built to contain six demon lords indefinitely. Only Leah's will holds it together. Then I must hurry. I wish we could do more for Leah. Maybe I could hold the stone together for a while. We both know Adria would not allow that. Come with me. Very well. I'm glad this is almost done. I don't... I don't think I have much time left. I would know if your time was near. It is not. Think of your future. The inn you want to build. No. You were right. There's no safe place for anyone. Look around us. If this keep can't protect us, what chance would a silly little inn have? Take comfort in the refuge of your mind. So long as your thoughts are your own, you have a defense against fear. The demonic rage is building up again. But I can do this. I know I can. Thank you. Leah's suffering grows with each passing moment. Everyone suffers. But to do so for a cause greater than oneself. That is the mark of a true hero. My daughter is everything I hoped she would be.
I am once again filled with the thrill of battle. It has been too long since I have raised my blade against the forces of the Burning Hells. I remember countless battles within the heart of Pandemonium, as my brethren and I risked everything to drive the demon spawn back to their hells. Light and darkness are essential to the balance. They must have been incredible battles. They were glorious. We waged our eternal conflict since the light first broke upon creation. But now, for the first time, it feels as if its end is in sight. You are a great warrior. No. I merely have a good commander. I do what I can. Imperius himself would have been hard-pressed to hold these walls as long as these soldiers have. This world owes them a great debt. Imperius? I do not know him. Imperius is the Archangel of Valor. It is he who commands the legions of the High Heavens. Which battle do you remember best? We thought we had lost everything at the Fifth Battle of the Diamond Gates. The Prime Evils and their legions crashed against the very entrance of Heaven itself. But one of my most trusted lieutenants, Iswal, turned them back. Still, the day might have been lost had the Demon Lords not fallen to fighting amongst themselves. So confident of their impending victory, they turned on each other over the spoils they had yet to win. I shudder to think what the Demon Lords might accomplish should they ever stop betraying one another. Such is the self-defeating nature of evil. <laughs>